Hello and welcome back to Moonring. Um, so I won't lie, it's been like a good week or maybe maybe even two weeks since I last played this. I was uh I was kind of stuck. Um, but I've gotten some useful tips uh, and I've been kind of like deliberately holding off so that maybe um, someone or a couple of people could uh, could give me some tips and and uh, I think. I think y'all have been doing really good. I, I mean, like, I know it's not on you to figure this game out. And uh, I think part of it is that the game's actually really quite difficult to research. Like, it's really niche. <clears throat> it's like not very well known. It's not being very well covered except by people who cover niche games. And uh, it makes it quite difficult to like search up things which is kind of nice in a way it means that like uh you know i'm i'm, I'm kind of left to my own devices in a sense so um what's the plan today well uh one uh fine uh, gentleman in the comments was telling me that uh, i should be marking things off with tab on the map which is a great way of using that i think part of the reason i wasn't doing that is because uh it makes the map kind of a mess eventually but i'm gonna go ahead and, and not care about that um at a certain point so um i can't remember if we like yeah this this is the problem is that you only get the one mark so you may as well use it to mark off uh and that would have been really helpful to do uh in the beginning <laughs> if i had actually been using that properly um, I'm gonna go I think I came here to check out the temple of shield So we're gonna go check that out uh, Looks to me wait. Are we at the temple of shield? We are at the temple of shield. Did I already do this? Uh, sorry, you'll have to forgive me. I'm, I'm uh, Kind of um, finding my legs again um, The other thing the other uh, nice tip was um, Hey, uh, use that wait completed the devotional task find f 15 lesser ruins in the overworld wow that's a quite a way to start the session um wonder what god that's with i'm gonna go ahead and throw that over there so that i don't um i don't get hit by it those uh bloodstones are really hard to see what god did I just gain devotion with? Oh, perfect. I was actually going to say the other nice tip that the timing on that couldn't have been better um, was, hey, uh, you have an ability that lets you see secret doors. You don't have to bump into every single wall. And, um, you know, I I got to say, I really appreciate it. I, I've gotten snarky tips before. Um, this was not that. And, and I just really appreciate Like if I miss something obvious, it's, uh, you know, it's, it's, uh, it sucks. Like, uh, I understand it's probably frustrating to, to watch, but it's always nice when, uh, when someone, hey, like, you know, gives me like a fr friendly nudge, like little reminder, hey, you missed something. Uh, it's, it's right there and don't, you know, and that's, that's nice. I appreciate that. Um, so thank you very much, uh, the, the comments have been been very helpful um i also got a reminder hey uh you have poise which is something you can actually use tactically and not just like throw away at the shortest notice uh appreciate that as well i that's like totally valid i, I honestly the only explanation for that one um is laziness i just kind of like get kind of lazy with it and um so it's Eventually, I just like don't don't use poise anymore. At least not uh, optimally. There's not there's not really a good excuse for that. I've talked about not wanting to play games optimally, but that's not necessarily a good example of that. Just like you know, use them use the mechanics that the game actually offers you instead of just like throwing throwing yourself away. Now, what what are what is this uh, cross swords I have? Oh, I wanted to check out that temple. Hold on. Yeah, we haven't done this temple yet. Unlocked. So, um, let me put on our cool bar. What does Purging Cross do? Oh, Purging Cross is like a good attack. 
Strike a large cross-shaped area centered on your position with a powerful moonlight attack. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. Um, I don't think we need gash for a while. I think I have enough blood. <laughs> burrowing shot is good. I know, I know that burrowing shot is good. Retribution. I don't think I'll be using retribution. I don't think it's very good. Um, I think it's okay, but I don't think it's like the end all be all, uh, like defensive spell that I wanted it to be. Ah, okay. Um, I guess I shouldn't have used any spell because uh, I didn't realize we were going to be fighting a thing. So we have three devotional tiers. I should probably use those at some point. Um, what do we want to do? Uh, I think I want to use a potion of, um, Staria root. Maybe we could do just a Staria root. I don't know if we have any Staria drafts. We do have a Staria draft. I don't know how much that gets us back, but let's go ahead and drink that. It might be a waste. And I'm going to summon the Paragon. I was trying to time the, the trap. I did not time it well. I can't really uh, assist because as soon as I attack anything, the angel is dead and the angel died anyway. What is the, what's with the cross swords above my head? Is that the revelation thing working its magic? Uh, I'm going to take another stereo draft. Ouch. Poise is broken. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and throw down a construct if I have any. I don't think I do have any, and I also don't seem to have enough to build one. Thrasher gland. Um, I wonder if I'm supposed to use those. I thought that it would convert them into what's its. Uh, I, I, I could potentially be one hit away from death here. Throw down a blood. St oh God. I got hit and they didn't. That's really cool. Um, can we slam them? I kind of don't want to slam them. I kind of want to get enough for conversion so I don't bleed to death. Or another bloodstone. Are you kidding me? Okay, well, if I don't use a potion right now, then I will die. So let's go ahead and drink a potion. Yo, this guy sucks. Uh, I, I, I went ahead and, and died there. Um... You died with an anchored ship. Ships, ship locations may be found by checking your map or reset to a dock by entering a coastal town. Interesting. Do I still have... Yeah, I still have revelation. Okay, cool. Um, let's try again. I don't expect this necessarily to be easy. It is a, a legendary item I am getting. All the same. Um, you know, it is proving to be quite difficult. I don't think I'm going to use bloodstones on this guy. Dodge. That's nice. I dodged again. That was really cool. Um, just wondering if there's... I could try I could try using retribution. I guess this is a uh, before I put it on my cool bar. Um Re revelation on my cool bar. Um If I use revelation, it could be good. I imagine um it will do some damage to him. I I tried and it actually paid off this time. Yay, I did it. Wait. There's still a lad here to kill. 
Okay, uh, I'm not bleeding. So that's nice. Cool. Shield of warding. Found a Oh, reward two devotion. Right. I forgot you get two devotion every time you get one of these. Well, not every time because you, uh, two of them have redundancy. Not two of them. Like, there's one re item of redundancy with each, um, with, with each god. So we tab, is this, is it tab as add item or icon? There we go. Wait, why, why I didn't do it? <laughs> okay, I think that's done it now. Double check. And yeah, okay, so that's that done. Um, Tower of Veils is something we have to do. I do want to do Temple of Sword. So let's go to Temple of Sword. We have no poise. I wonder why have, we have no poise right now. Oh, that's because we weren't landed. Um, wonder if we could do a camp. Let's eat some moldy hedgehog meat. I know we have, uh, I know we have mushroom jerky, but you know, that stuff's never going to go bad. And, um, can we, can we stop for, like, can we rest? And so what, what are we doing? I mean, um, there's a couple things we need to do. We need to find the last temple and I, I'm pretty sure it's whatever magma temple. There's one more temple that has a, uh, I think a locust part in it. Um, and, uh, and then we're basically just like, I'm doing legendary, uh, items. We are knocking off some of these, um, like godly temples. We'll eventually have to do the jest. Um, we are going to need to do the Tower of Veils, which is going to be a pain. We'll have to do the uh, Necropolis, which we can do. Um, so like we are, we are like very slowly wrapping things up. Um, I believe I have all of the names of like all of the gods. So that's taken care of. Um, so yeah, like the most, most things are kind of taken care of. I just need to, you know, we, we need to find that last temple. Not sure where it is. I can't really look it up. So we'll have to, um, you know, do things the old fashioned way. Uh, I could do it off screen. I could definitely explore the world off screen, but I figure I may as well just like do these legendary temples. This will be like a episode. You guys really attacked me while I was asleep, huh? Not cool. Ah, uh, you dudes. I, I'm not. I'm not gonna fight you guys. That would be unfair to you. Yeah. Okay. We have another um, lad. I'm gonna go ahead. We have a lot of traps here. Wow, that angel did not last long. I wonder if you could make a beeline for the for the chest. Um so they knocked me onto a vent and I'm on fire. Kinda want to take another Staria draft. I guess I should have I should be using that shield, huh? Melee, armor, shield of warding. What's it requirement? Uh, the requirements are endurance. Um, actually wouldn't give me any more physical defense. It would give me some block though. 30% block. I may as well use it. Cannot wield the shield at the same time as a great scythe. Okay. Well, that kind of sucks. I guess if I get this great sword, uh, then I may switch up from that from the great scythe but we'll see um otherwise i am going to be in a spot of bother here let's take a staria draft and then summon another angel i 
and now um yeah they 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 break our poise almost immediately i'm gonna be doing as much damage as i can we could do uh we could do a burrowing shot here i i i you know the reason i use the um bloodstone so often is it does just really ridiculously good damage mostly uh out of cheesiness like it it, it kind of cheeses things because it's it shoots out like a number of bloodstones that all do some damage even if they don't cause bleeding and uh so if you put it right next to an enemy it will just like hit them like a bunch of times um so i do acknowledge the fact that it is a little bit cheesy but uh, i've hurt myself more often than not so how cheesy is it really trying to avoid he's about to yeah move in i have to wonder if there's a way to avoid that okay so yeah i do i am starting to recognize when they're uh going to do their teleport move so that that worked out well i actually didn't expect to win that one here let's try our cool oh never mind we don't have enough for rele revelation do we how much does it cost 40. okay i do wonder um Okay, we got two devotion, find a legendary sword, axe, or club. Okay, I guess there's three items for uh, that are, like, redundant. I do wonder, like, if we are going to have to fight the gods, and I don't know if that's where we're headed with this, um, are we going to lose all of our spells? You know? In order, like, are we going to have to fight them without spells? Am I going to have to do it legit? Spooky thoughts. Uh, I wonder how, how I recover this. With their strange aversion to witchcraft and its curative potions. I think I can get this recovered if I go, like, visit someone, but I can't remember who and where and what, you know. Do I need... No, I don't have any unidentified ob uh, objects. Um, so we have quite a lot of devotion to spend. How much, uh, what do I need to use this? Where, what, didn't I just get a sword? Oh, Ar Ar Arthrana. Main weapon of Grania of the Hand. Strength required 30. We are at strength 25, so just barely not enough. Um, it is a downgrade speaking, uh, for physical damage and our dodge only a slight downgrade for dodge but it does magic damage which is nice uh it doesn't cause bleed however i don't think the bleed has really helped us and we can always use bloodstones for bleed so it's not a big deal um it doesn't have as much critical chance it's almost a lateral move but the nice thing is that if we do use this then that means we can use the shield which would help us um we do need more endurance though that much is true so uh let's see what we can do here we have two points to spend um so if we buy this then we'll have enough strength so let's go ahead and do that uh and we're gonna need some more endurance i believe that is not the blind angels isn't that the sanguine moon that is uh, endurance no that's perception it is the blind angels that is endurance Okay, um, stopping those within its bounds doing harm. Oh, that's interesting. That might actually be really valuable. Um, kind of tempted to spend a bunch of devotional points on the blind angels for that extra endurance. But I don't know if that's going to be very helpful. Uh, but for now, let's go ahead and spend one devote. The game just crashed. Devs. Devs. Game just crashed. Hello? Hello? I have to do that temple again, devs. 
re well that sucks ain't gonna lie about that one that's the first time that game's the great the game's crashed on me i i don't think the game has crashed on me before i wonder if one of the recent patches uh did more harm than good i would hate that i would hate i i, I would not lie i would it would be such a it would be a shame if that was the case ouch hey paragon you want to do something thank you oh my god paragon you were almost less than worthless i will say let's shoot him and shoot him again resist bleeding uh, i'm not gonna do burrowing shot i like the idea of burrowing shot i think more often than not it's not gonna be what i want to do Ouch. Bloodstone, please don't teleport. Well, bloodstone. Ow! No, I'm bleeding. Okay, uh, leave the area. This is my, my little exploit for, uh, not having to deal with the, the bleeding that I have caused myself. Okay, well, um, you know, uh, shit happens sometimes, and that's, that is an example of the kind of shit that can happen. So, I'm gonna leave first, and then I'm gonna fiddle with my inventory and devotional stars, whatever. Um, let's go ahead and find our devotion. Where are they? I never know where they are, though. There they are. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and throw one devotional tier onto endurance and then we're gonna buy this spell and then we're gonna again buy this spell and then we're gonna equip in our melee uh arthrana that's actually gonna put us oh okay we're, we're okay for endurance we're okay but the problem is is that we also need to equip the shield shield of warding and that's gonna put us over so we still need more endurance if we want to maintain uh 100 move speed Cannot wield a sheer shield. What do you mean I can't wield a shield at the same time as Arthrana? What do you mean? What is what, sword and board? They call it sword and board for a reason. This is my board. Why can't I wear? Why, why can't I use a shield with the sword? That's kind of weird. Main weapon, uh, personal, uh, pecu peculiar choice considering the house's wards. Words become weapons credo. Oh, well, that's kind of a bummer. Finesse required 30. I'm just wondering now, can I use like God's needle? Oh, I, right. I need, I need more finesse. How much finesse do I need? Can I just like make this happen? Each time your devotion increases, you gain five points in that attributes are you okay okay thank you go away uh i assume that it's death's harlequin that is finesse yes that is true um i don't value a lot of these skills so i'll just go oh i guess i need 30 finesse so that's not even gonna get me even close right yeah i'm at 20 finesse right now so i'd have to complete some uh of the harlequin's like missions um, what does it want me to do? Oh, wrong thing. Defeat 50 enemies while insane. I already did that. Suffer every type of status effect. Apparently, I'm very close to that. Become cursed by every other god. Okay, that's silly. Gain the trickster's mask. Uh, yeah, well, I mean, that's... I'm working on it. Uh, we've done everything that the wolf wants us to do. Um... We need to gain the pale heart. <clears throat> Enter all of the overworld hinges. I think I'm only missing one. And I actually think it's on the ring. Because I saw one person, uh, I saw a map that had a, uh, like a guiding line to the ring. But that would only get us, I guess that would get us two devotion. What does this uh, give us? Intellect. 
Reduces materials required for magic item repair. Eh, I mean, that's nice. Increases sight, range, and accuracy. That would be nice, but, uh, you know, can't really do it. Honestly, okay, what do... Gain the all-seeing eye. I don't know where that is. I'm not sure where the all-seeing eye is. Do we even have a lead on that? I'm kind of bummed out that I can't use the shield. Why can't I use the shield? Like, I can use this shield, but, like, how... Like, uh, to what... How... Hmm. Yes, okay. Unequip. Unequip this. And equip this. I, well, I just want to know, like, what weapon could I use it with? Like, a, okay, so a rapier. Um, so that would suggest to me that we could use it with uh, God's Needle. Which would be nice. We can use the Great Arc. That is, um... Perception required 30. Wow, okay, so we can use the nice bow. So, uh, what we need to do is get our finesse up if we want to use the shield. And I do want to use the shield because why not use the shield, right? Seems like we're kind of um, not making the best of our equipment if I don't use the shield. But for now, uh, I'm going to take it off and we're going to go ahead and continue using the Great Scythe because it is actually quite a good item. Um, okay. Maybe there's another great weapon that we can use with the shield. I'm going to go back to this temple and uh, quick save. I saw one, like, someone was uh, replying to a comment or something and they were like... Just go ahead and like save and then, uh, you know, head to whatever, blah, blah, blah. And someone was like, what do you mean save? You can't save in this game. The game just auto saves. <laughs> like, uh, I don't know. Uh, do, do you think it's exploitative that I use the, like, I use the fact that it auto saves when I enter dungeons as a, as a means of manually saving? Is that, is that exploitative, do you think? Okay, let's rest. We have 15,000 guineas. I can probably get a really nice rapier, rapier at um, Harrow Dus. I seem to recall they are like, you know, they're cool. They're, they're, they're good with uh, like those kind of weapons. Do you have any potions? I would buy all of your potions. Doesn't look like you do. I thought this, I thought that meant potions. Am I just wrong about that? Do you have anything cool? Uh, a dark pin. Stubby iron handle with a congealed shadow where the blade should be. You suspect this came from a Sibaroon cache and that you are far from its first owner. Well, I mean, the one nice thing is that we have the best bow we can possibly have. Uh, town opinion. I don't care about town opinion. Sorry. I can fill a bottle with, with, uh, empty water. That must be new. I don't remember that being a thing. Ah, here we go. I, I need to re replenish my, um... Yeah, potions. Let's go ahead and buy all of those. And I'll buy all of those as well. Uh, we could buy some more Amber Bane Ward Oil. It's, it's not very expensive. Okay, and now we leave. So uh, I am going to make a trip to the southwest because I think there is something I couldn't do before and maybe now I can, but I'm not sure. That's a hedge right there. I think there's a I think there's a hedge like there or there. There's like a couple of spots there and there, but um, I'm not seeing a symbol like this. They're pretty like explicitly labeled on the map. So I don't know. Maybe I didn't visit it. Well, maybe I did a bad. Did I do bad? 
Oh god, please. Please, leave me alone. Oh my god, you guys suck. Okay, backing up and uh, shooting the rest of them. Here we go. That's how you use your poise. Hey, we got an unknown device. That's kind of nice. Let's uh, have a look at that immediately. Oh yeah, what are these quest items? Great key, chest key, steadfast hand. This The fingers are particularly flexible, though the mechanisms enabling this are quite invisible, which is solvent. Lesson's head. Um, huh. Black eyed stone. Still don't really know what I'm supposed to do this with this. Um, highly valued for the amber oil that may be extracted from it. How do I extract oil from the thrasher gland? Is a question I'm asking myself. I do appreciate how wind works in this game, uh, meaning I, I appreciate that wind works at all in this game. Like, there's so many games that have, like, ship stuff in it, like, you know, uh, ship movement, and it doesn't, you know, they don't have wind, and it doesn't make very much sense. And I appreciate that, like, an extra bit of thought was put into uh, how a ship would actually move in this game. It's quite nice. Okay, um, I'm just double checking what this is because I feel like this might have been something. Uh, we're, we're getting ambered right now, so hold on. Let me use some amber oil. Is this nothing? There's no way this is nothing, right? I wonder if I did like, um, a revelation here. Gifts not available at this time. This just feels like it should be something. I'm assuming uh, devices. Um, oh yeah, let's, uh, let's use our Rosetta for a second. Glass orb. Orb of untrapping, yay. Um, Roche's bell? Bell is silent. I mean, uh, you know, of course it's silent. Um... You would think that this would be something. I'm not I'm not losing my mind, right? Behind this mountain maybe? I don't know. I mean I'm willing to believe this this is nothing, but it just feels too um suspicious. Oh no, I'm insane. Uh, I'm gonna die. That's fine. I mean, it's not fine. Um, that actually kind of sucks because I was quite far away. So, yeah, there was that. Um, we I want to check out what that is again, real quick. But besides those two things, I, like, I don't think, I don't know if there's any, like, I don't know where the last henge is. And I'm not sure, I, I guess, you know, the, the episode's almost over. Let's, let's just state that. Uh, I want to, I, I like, I want to do the other legendary dungeon, dungeons and, like, just, like, get some of that nice equipment. 
Uh, and also it's like free devotional tiers, basically, right? That was a weird kind of graphical glitch. I think I'm, am I just supposed to sell Thrasher Gland? Is that the deal? Oh, I didn't see this island before. Or maybe I did. Either way, it seems kind of pointless. Starving. I, I know, I'm starving. Uh, there's just like fire there. There's just fire there and I can't get to it. I wonder if I can shoot it. Can I shoot the fire? No, I can't. It's like at the perfect angle for me not to be able to shoot. Okay. Um, well, that's interesting. I can't reach that. Um, it's a good thing to remind myself about these things, you know, but uh, I kind of wish the, you know, they were leading to something. I've got some like magma over here. You'd think that that would be something, but can't really get there. I get it. I get it. I'm starving. I know. I just want to have a double... Yeah, there's nothing over here. Not that I can see anyway. Okay. Um, well. All right, let's let's see here. Um, did I mark off that other temple by the way? Temple of the Sword. No, I didn't. I don't know. T marking things doesn't seem to work sometimes. Oh, okay, there we go. It does work. Um, all right, so we've been there. We need to go to Tower of Veils. Did I accidentally put like a marker here? I think I did. And here. <laughs> uh, I guess there's two different kinds of marks now. I don't know if that was always the case before, but that's actually, that is actually helpful. Um, I know we've been to Venom Cube. Garden of Lor Lorelei. So where, where are we going to next? I don't know if we wait we went there we probably want to get the temple we want to go to the temple of the dagger temple of the rapier um didn't we do that because i have god's needle isn't that what i got from uh, tem uh, temple of rapier hold on if if that's the case then i would have completed the mission yeah find a legendary rapier or dagger um it seems like there is no item for Lord of Dust. He just, they, they just like you to discover wands and stuff and then enter all the henges. We're actually kind of close to both of those, but you know. Uh, find a legendary bow, find a legendary shield. So we've pretty much completed like most of the, um, legendary items like we could go i think we already have the legendary uh rep here i think that that is the uh god's needle ancient sibarun had no need of gods this weapon was crafted as a whimsical commentary on the culture's atheism this this to me seems like uh the the best rep here um we could go to like temple of axe i don't know where that is temple of axe and then there's like also temple of club that i probably could go to at some point but yeah i'm kind of stuck right now um well there's temple of the mace i think what i'll do is between this and the next episode uh i'm just gonna explore the world like i'll i'll fill in all of the the water and um i'm just gonna like Fill in every single nook and cranny. You don't need to see that. And I'm just going to do as much exploration as I possibly can. And um, we're going to get this done. 
if you are enjoying this series, definitely hit the like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.